a sample of what I can do. We'll see how tough Rhea really is against someone that can actually hit her back. What up, y'all? This your boy Ace here. Welcome to Afternoon's Delight. Let's talk about it, man. So I did the video. The first video I did this week was about me and Yale's surprise attack appearance on Rhea Ripley in Judgment Day. And so we caught up with him backstage. Byron Saxton had an interview with them backstage. And they were basically uh, celebrating a little bit, you know, that they finally found the solution to the Rhea Ripley problem. So, you know, me and Yim actually talked about how she was fine, you know, she uh, Rhea Ripley finally had someone that she could fight with, you know, that, that wasn't a man. And uh, how she will take care of her and even the odds. And so... Uh, I, I, it, 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 and it's the toughest woman in the building, man, to take care of uh, Rhea Ripley here. Uh, it, uh, it's obviously someone that will hit her back. And I was talking earlier about I love the fit. Like, like actually love the fit, you know, them having a female in the group. Uh, I think it actually puts the OC on a different stratosphere to have Mia Yim in the group. Um, they need to keep her there, not just for the Rhea Ripley storyline. But I think she's a le legit tough woman to be with them, you know, because this group kind of reminds me of like a somewhat of a, you remember APA with uh, uh, the old Brad, the original Brad Shaw before he became JBL uh, and Farouk. Uh, it'd it be, it be interesting and it, 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 if they had some kind of group like that, a faction like that, with me and Yim in it. I think that'd be cool. Because me and Yim's like one of the perfect people that they could choose. Because she's really tough. Shasi was like the only other person that I could figure out on the roster that they could put with her. It was going to have to be somebody on the NXT roster. So I started thinking of like, I think Zoe Stark could could go could go with them. You know what I mean? But I don't know if they were ready to bring Zoe Stark up yet from NXT. But like that was one of the people I was thinking of. But I love the fit. I'm going to love how this is going to go with Rhea Ripley. How is Rhea Ripley going to fit? I think Judgment Day is going to figure something out to uh, to do to 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 get the odds back in their favor. I think they're going to figure something out, but I don't think it's going to be into war games. Obviously, these two teams are probably going to be fighting at war games, but the, the odds are even right now. The OC have their girl. Rhea Ripley ain't going to be able to do much the next few weeks. And, uh it's going to be interesting. Go back and watch that video when she attacked him, man. I just saw that Ross. I'm probably going to edit it into that video. I saw his reaction. He was going nuts. Uh, it, it was awesome, guys. It, it was it was totally awesome, man. I'm going in to get this video a like, man. Hit the like button for me. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel, especially if you're new in the zoo. Any comments I got, definitely put them below. And if you want to donate to the channel, hit the super thanks button below. I much appreciate it, y'all. Or you could donate to the Cash App. The Cash App tag is on the si uh, on the screen here. Dollar Sign Sack Exchange. Big shout out to Rob Smith who sent in the $5 dono. Also, an $80 dono from Secret Care. Big one just a few days ago. So if y'all want to shout out in these videos like them, man, all you got to do is donate, man. But yeah, so they went out. You know, They were going to go get some drinks. And uh, Mia Yim said she's going to pay. She seems like a perfect fit, man. Like... You know, she's Keith Lee's husband in real life. I, I think she can roll with this crew, man. I think she can roll with Ant, uh, Doc and Gallows and uh, AJ Styles, man, uh, and Carl Anderson, man. I, I think they, I think she, I think she works in perfectly with him. Like, this is one of the most perfect fits that they could have found as any girl, girls on the roster. There wasn't too many girls that they could choose from outside of Shasi and Zoe Stark, man. Like, it had to be, like, one of them three girls. I think Alba Fire might have worked, but... She's, she's somewhat like a supernatural character, almost like almost a little bit. So I don't know if that would have totally worked, but uh, but me me and him is just straight up street. Like you you could tell the fit works. The fit just works, man. I'm loving it. I want to see what they're gonna do beyond Judgment Day. I think they could get some things going on. I think that I think they just really turned the OC around. You know how with Judgment Day they did it. So I think I'm gonna put up a poll y'all today. Asking y'all about me and you. Um, I'm not sure what the question is yet, but definitely participate in the poll in the community tab, y'all. So I'll see y'all in. Thank y'all for watching. After news to like.